Let's take a look at some of the advanced soundboard features in Noisomatic. You can use hotkey sequences to group sounds by your own mnemonic rules or categories. As an example, let's say that I want all my local sounds to be played when I press Control 1. I can edit the hotkey, like we normally do, and press a sequence, for example, Control 1 followed by Control Q. Now let's say that I want some of my cloned voice hotkeys to be grouped and played when I press Control 2. Like I did before, I can define a sequence. In this case, Control 2 followed by Control Q. This way, I have the same Q key bound to two different sounds. I just have to press the correct sequence. Control 1 followed by Control Q. And Control 2 followed by Control Q. It is that easy. Furthermore, you can now bind a key to provide an automatic push to talk button. Expand the controls from the bottom right corner and click the Edit Auto Key button. Select your hotkey that will be virtually pushed whenever you're playing your desired sound. This is especially useful when playing games, but can also be used in any voice application, too. And the best thing? You can set a different auto hotkey for every channel. Make some noise!